morning everybody it is monday i am now editing the weekend's vlog is downstairs i've got to put the video editor on my new laptop i've been really lazy getting that up and running just so the the laptop downstairs can be cleared so paul can use it for other things he doesn't use it very often be just checking his email and his zoom and i'll still be using it for certain things like um, jennifer's childcare um fees as you see i'm in bed because i finished my work i found my mum got a cup of tea and paul said why don't you go to bed for a couple hours have a bit more rest because then I'll be up to playing with Jennifer later on when she comes home. I'm looking forward to it. She's so sweet. So yes, uh, plan for today is I've got two items I'm waiting on payment for. So fingers crossed they pay. If they do, they'll be posted tomorrow. So it means I need to top up my drop and go account. I need to change the bank card on said drop and go account and so on. I've already started colouring my page for the one we're doing with colour in heaven colour in heaven are having a little daily colouring thing where we colour one page of the advent calendar in the Chris cutesy christmas there are two and you can do one uh, one from either calendar so i've started mine i've only got a little bit left to do so i'll be doing that later yes <sighs> Oh, excuse me, I've started doing it in the Relax With Art Christmas um, magazine. That's a nice one as well. It's a Santa one. I started doing that last night when Jennifer was colouring. Uh, yeah, lots of colouring going on. I'll do some eBay tonight. I'm not filming today. I have got, obviously, the daily vlog to go up today. And tomorrow I'll be putting up, you'll have seen it by now, the first part of the Arteza First Impressions, which is great because I want to use them for something else. Just to have a play with them. And then I'm going to, on tomorrow night, I'll be filming the next part of my colouring chat using the Castle Arts watercolours. Which you'll have all seen all this by now, I don't know why I'm even telling you. But that's my plan for, for today, is today, get Jennifer, go to mum and dad's, play with Jennifer, have tea, wash up, pack items if they've been paid for, they haven't yet, fingers crossed they will. And then do eBay tonight, I'm going to do some photos tonight. So... It's so not a filming night tonight. It's an eBay night, so I'm just going to photograph as much as I can, measure it, and then I've got to, I can upload, get it done. Um, I have got five I can put up tonight, so I will do that. I might only put three. Doesn't make much difference. And then I'll get as many as I can done. I have got some still on my phone to do, but I'm backing it out with pictures, so I'm going to have to get them drafted this afternoon. That's it for now. Like Paul said, I'm going to go and have a little sleep now. I will admit, I was a bit of a kid last night, and I read... First term at Mallory Towers by Enid Blyton because I bought a box set of the first six books and I read the whole thing. It was great. It was like being a kid again. I might read the second one tonight because I really enjoyed it. I bought them for when Jennifer's older, really. I do that every now and again if I see someone and I pick it. I was only a couple of quid in the charity shop, so like money goes to charity, so I don't mind the condition. And I really enjoyed it. But that's it for now. I'll see you when I uh Go and get Jen. Got to set my alarm now. Make sure I Jennifer. Now, I picked up Jennifer, and now she's cuddling Rosie because she's over her fear of dogs a bit now, and she likes to fuss her. Don't you, Jen? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Rose. It's all right. She won't hurt you. Rose is quite a timid little dog, big dog. Oh, she. You got chocolate on your chops. Hmm. 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 There's Rose. There's Rose. You first in rows? Rose. Shh, not so squeaky. You frighten the dog. She's very timid, aren't you, darling? Yeah, you beautiful girl. Don't know, she's just shouting. You're frightened. No, shh, you're frightened the dog. Don't frighten her, are you? Ah, no, no. Ow, that's enough now, Jennifer. You hurt the dog now. No, you banged it when she didn't actually. Well, could have. Hi guys, it's Tuesday afternoon and I forgot to vlog all yesterday, but that's okay because not a lot happened. Jennifer had sleep and she had night terrors in her afternoon nap and then she didn't want to go to bed. But she did and she was fine. And I had a night off of doing anything, just a bit of colouring, watched a bit of YouTube, chilled out. So, um, it's about 20 to 1. I've got to pick Jen up in five minutes. I'm just going to pop to the shop and get a few bits and go to the chip shop because it's chip shop day. And I can smell them from here. It's blinking lovely. So, yeah, it's a gorgeous day. A bit of cloud, but the sun's out and 
bit of blue sky cold it feels cold it feels very wintry but it's quite kind of nice so we might take Jennifer for a walk over the park and down the river so after dinner I'll see you in a bit here we are in the park she ran to the swing as soon as I walked up she went sit down mummy and pointed at the bench so hence why I'm sitting down it's nice watching her little legs as she runs to the park she's so sweet she has a good day at nursery she had all her lunch and she had some of my sausage and chips which I actually share with Nana played in the garden for a bit and then we come down here it's not too bad it's chilly it's not cold the sun's out a little bit it's a bit cloudy as you can see but not bad for December Going fast. 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 You gotta take off in a minute. Uh, it's isn't it? What's the matter? Yeah. Don't like it. You don't like anything today, do you? You're a bit what? She doesn't like it. <laughs> I know she does. Oh, Is it hard work? Is that hard work? Big clouds up there, mm. isn't it? Big, black, Big clouds. Oh, oh, little birdie up there. Look. Lots of birdies. Look. 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 birdies. Birds. Hey, birds. Birds. Birds, that's right. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's all a tea for. Oh, what up there, aren't they? Tea. They're going to fly over their tea now. Do you want to go home? You want to stay in the park? Oh, here! Yeah. <laughs> it goes click. Click. Yeah. You crunch it. Oh! Hair. I'm guessing it's your hair. What's that? That's too short. What's that? That one. That's a field over there, isn't it? Mm. That. Oh, sheep. Birds again. Birds again. Oh yeah, it's got a big bird. Yeah, it's got a big bird. It's got a big bird. Oh, it's starting to rain. It's starting to rain. Mm. Oh dear. We'll leave you here then. It's we'll going to get a bit wet, Jen. You can stay here and get wet. Do you want to get a bit wet? Oh, baby pop. That little soggy face, eh? In the park. You're raining. in the park, but it's starting to rain, Jen, so we're going to be careful. Come in next time, it was nice. <laughs> oh, you're fast. You like that, don't you? I like it. You like it? Yeah. Good girl. Hi, guys, it is actually Wednesday evening. I haven't vlogged all day, I just forgot, it's been one of those days. Um, systems were down all morning, so I didn't do much at work. Did do a few emails, took a few calls, but oh, it was a nightmare. Then went to get Jennifer. Had some lunch, fell asleep. Jennifer went to sleep, had tea and that's about it, so nothing's happened. Tomorrow I plan to go to what? Because I need to take Dad because his car is damaged. Some twat swiped the mirror the driver's side wing mirror off and his street is so wide you could get a bloody couple of buses down there anyway the guys that did it's going to pay for it and he's going to get a new wing mirror but uh, he doesn't want to drive it without one so and it's, I mean, it's literally torn off um, so I said I'd take him to what tomorrow because I want to get something if I can and then on Friday I'll take him to Little shopping because um, he takes me everywhere although we are off Friday we've got things to do in the morning I am now doing my colouring chat in Cutesy Christmas. I've been colouring in burlesque. I've got one Deborah Muller that I want to start colouring in a minute, in a bit. And I got a little bit to do on my laptop tonight before I go to sleep. And I'm watching something called Geographics on YouTube. It's really interesting. It's historical, it's geological, it's geography. It's a bit of everything. So, so far I've watched about the eruption of Mount St. Helens today. And that was back in 1980. Um, a bit about Monaco is what I'm currently watching. All sorts of different things that they, they talk about, which is great. Really enjoy it. 
um, yeah, I got another packet of Link Shines, but this time they are just the red ones. So now I've got the gold ones and the red ones. Love them. I want to go and order the Colour in Heaven collection, the non-subscription issue, because it's a chibi one. Apparently it's out and people have got it already, I didn't even know. And apparently the sneak peek has come out. I haven't looked. I will in a bit. But I'm going to crack on with that and I'll see you tomorrow, because, you know... Bit of a non day, I'm afraid. Hopefully, tomorrow will be better. And this weekend, Friday, we're clearing up the living room, giving it a good clean, tidy hoover, putting all the toys away, putting them out of the way so we can get the Christmas tree down on the weekend, which will be nice. It's just easier to do it when Jennifer's out of the way. She'll be at uh, um, nursery. So we'll take her to nursery. We're going to have breakfast up at the Prince and then we're going to. Uh, Get it sorted so we can get the decorations up. Well, the Christmas tree, I don't put a lot of decorations up. The Christmas tree is the main thing, though. Time to crack on. I'll see you in the morning, as long as I remember. Good morning, everybody, and welcome back. It is Thursday, the 10th of December. I can't believe it's the 10th of December already. Um, I'm all set up, ready to start work. I'm just waiting for one day to base load. Uh, it won't be long. And I've got eight minutes, so I'm just going to chill out for five minutes and uh, play on my phone. I've got to take my dad to do some shopping today because his car needs us to have a fix. So we're going to go and get a small Christmas tree because he doesn't want to put the big one up. So they get a small one. Because Chris isn't coming home and it's just going to be him and mum on Christmas Day because I've got, obviously, Paul's mum coming because she's on her own. And he's really only putting it up for Jennifer, which is quite sweet, but... Uh, yeah, so we're going to go and do that. That's it, really. I don't know what else we'll be doing today. I've, I've got a video ready to go up tonight, which is uh, Thursday night, which is colour and chat, which I finished yesterday. I was very happy with that. That's about it, really. Going to uh, crack on and just chill out for a few minutes before I have to start my shift. So I'll see you afterwards. Jennifer, is it a big Santa? Jen, look at mum. Is it a big Santa? Giant Santa at what? In fact, there's two of them. Oh, another one. That's his brother. Two. That's his brother. Yeah, two Santas. And a little one there. Wait. I'm going to measure it before I come out. Wait. Oh, that'll be alright. Yeah, I don't want to get one. Cheese. Lots of trees. Oh, I'm just looking. It's a train. Yeah. Choo choo! 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 Santa's everywhere, isn't he, Jen? Well, there's a snowman. Well, snowman. Santa Claus. Santa Claus. Santa Claus. Santa. 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 Got lights on, isn't he? Let me see. Snowman. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's cheaper to get a real one, isn't it? Mind you, they only last one year generally, don't they? That's because they've got the lights built into them rather than you putting them on. There's Santa. The big Santa Claus, isn't it? Lose this one, isn't it? Yeah, but it's not practical for. No. 
But you could have that up all year round because it's not particularly yeah. Christmassy. Any stuff oh, have a quick look. What's around there? Ooh, baubles. Wreaths, lights. Maple leaf. All the lights. We've gone for a half tree, which is snow covered. So it's uh, 29 99 He's having a smaller one and it is actually going by their wall, so it makes sense. So oh, those lights are amazing. I never decorate properly. I should really. I do start getting I do get more and more things every year. Like we're getting the the hollow Santa this year, the hollow hollow Santa. I can see you. Garden, yeah. yeah, so yeah, we got that one. Yeah. So it's perfect. Yeah. I know, they're not good. Although, let's get back in the main shop where it's not so uh, rutty. I know. Hello, everybody. It's Friday morning. If you're wondering what happened to Thursday night, yeah, I just forgot. But I hope you enjoyed that little bit of Jennifer in what? Looking at being all cute and looking at things and getting very excited about Santa. Or well, Santan, as she calls him. We put a Santa, the Santa light we bought, we put it up on the mantelpiece to show it later when I've switched it on. We are currently going through the uh, post-Christmas clear up, i.e. getting everything ready to get the decorations and sound so we can put the tree up. So we're sorting through her toys, putting them away, getting rid of some of the ones she doesn't use. We've got all the battery ones that need battery replacements to one side because we need to see if they're working properly. We're going to do that in a bit. I'll go and get the batteries in a minute, Paul. If the batteries aren't working, we will throw them away, get rid of them. So we had a bit of fun with the hoover. We were like, why isn't this working properly? The roller's not spinning around there. We realised it was set to hard floor instead of carpet. That's sorted now. Bit dim, but there you go. But anyway, it's looking a lot better, the front room, where we sit mostly. We just need to do the dining room bit now, um, check all the battery stuff in the hallway, because her toy box goes in the hallway, so we can actually get the tree up. Otherwise, there's nowhere to put the tree. So that's our rest of the morning. Then I've got to go and get my dad, We're picking up Jennifer, because he needs to go shopping in his car still poorly. Oh, the joys. So that's what we've been doing. And we've had some 60s music on, haven't we, Paul? He's nodding. He doesn't want to be on camera. Probably because he's all sweaty like me. He's nodding, yeah. You'll probably see him later when he's a bit more presentable. <laughs> he's silly sod. Anyway, I'm going to have a little drink of coke and then uh, crack on. We can put a guitar and a, a keyboard in the tray that, but down the side now. We've, now we've hoovered. Our, our, our sofa here, this leather recliner, is so heavy. It does, and our coffee table, mind, mind you, it's full of stuff, but it's because it's got drawers in it, but it's still heavy without anything in it. But the recliner is so heavy, and I can move it on my own, and I have known, been known to move it and hoover on my own. But it is easier with two people, but it is so heavy. And the amount of stuff that ends up behind it, like pens and pens and more pens and a pair of socks. In fact, two pairs of socks, because there were two dirty ones, no, three dirty ones. A pair of socks and an odd sock, and a pair of, well, were clean ones that Jennifer threw back there. Which obviously now we're in the washing machine for another wash, but at least I've retrieved them. Because she seems to be losing lots of socks. The sock monster's coming to eat them. Um, she had like five Peppa Pig socks. I think she's got like one odd one left. The rest of them have just disappeared into the ether. I don't know where. It's a bit like uh, loads of her blocks and bits from toys. It's like, well, where's the number nine gone? Can't find it. It's not been thrown away. It's just disappeared. So obviously there's a toy eating monster as well as a block, uh, as well as a sock eating monster. Anyway, gonna crack on. See you later. So one of the things I had a lot of hanging around in the dining area were cameras that I'd bought or were mine. So I put mine back on the shelf over there for now. Can't really see them. You'll see them later when I do the tree. And I've got a load here and on the stairs. Now these all work. I've just been lazy at not getting them listed. So my job for tonight is to get them photographed and listed on eBay. Which is great. I can also do a few other bits of um, stuff I've got upstairs to do. So yeah, 
great. I've got one camera I'm going to bin. I'm, actually, there's going to be two that I've been today, but I'm not worried. I like doing cameras. I bought so many. I've still got tons of them in the shed to test and go through. But I just want to get what I can listed and get them in the shed on the camera shelf ready for when they sell. So, yeah, good, glad, feeling better. Hey, everyone. It is Friday evening. So, again, I haven't done much vlogging. Um not been a lot to do really just obviously we were tidying up early as you saw and then I, I took granddad shopping my dad shopping which is fine and then we had dinner and that's it really it's, it's not that late it's probably about eight o'clock if that I think I'd have to check actually I haven't got a clue at 25 past I'm absolutely shattered again um probably from doing so much this afternoon and morning so I'm off to bed I mean I'm so tired I haven't even done my that there? Sorry. Um, oh, I know. Um, Advent calendar picture for the day. I'm going to turn the. I'm going to try and. I'm going to do it now before I go to sleep. But I'm literally going to go to bed. I am so so tired. It's not good. I will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow we go to Paul's mum's, and who knows what else will happen we, we always go to poor mums we pop to the charity shop which is around the corner which is it's actually a nice charity shop but you can it's, it's always so busy and they can have four people in at a time jennifer doesn't count they let her in anyway because she's a child but you feel bad taking a long time browsing because there's other people always waiting to get in so i'm just going to go to sleep and do that bit, bit of picture and go to sleep um and that's it really i'm just too tired to do anything else again it's ridiculous I just, uh, yeah, I don't know. I do too much. I work myself into a... Sleep. <laughs> anyway, I will see you in the morning. It is Saturday. Hooray! Yeah. It is Saturday! Yay! Cardigan on. I think. I'm trying to get Jennifer's cardigan on. So going over to see Paul's mum. We've been watching Paw Patrol, haven't we? And T-Rex Ranch. She came into my bed and wanted to watch TV in there, so we watched for a bit before we got up. And now we're going out. She was so cute. She's got this hat on with Santa, but she's got it on backwards, if you look. So, obviously, Santa's face should be at the front. I actually think Santa looks a bit like a Muppet. But, uh, here she is. Yeah. Is that you? Is that you? Ed, say hello. Hello. Oh, good girl. We're going to see Nanny. Yeah. Who's, who's that there? Who have you got in your hand? Show everybody. Who is it? Dog. It's Sky. We'll see Mum and Dad. Yeah, we'll be seeing my Mum and Dad after we've been to Daddy. So we've just been to Danny Sally's again. We're going for a walk down to the shop. Because the dog barks every time somebody walks along the path to get to and from the shops, which is understandable. You can hear the dog behind me having a whine because they've come with us. It's a nice high wall. Oh, well, they're going there, aren't they? And here. It's all right, Jen. She's behind us. Gorgeous, beautiful day today. Lots of sun today, isn't there, Jen? It's nice. Oh, it's a bit of a breeze. Sunny, isn't it? Always wants to go to the shop. St. Olive's Cemetery, which um, you won't recognise, but we will go in it one day. Um, you would recognise it because it's been used in uh, episodes of Doctor Who and Sherlock. It's where Sherlock's grave was. Um, yeah, it's a nice cemetery for a walk around. And we're at the shop now, so I'm going to get the face mask because we're going to go in the charity shop, I think. Oh, we're back from 
uh, Paul's mum's now. Jennifer's playing in her ball pit. I've been upstairs tidying up and got washing on and stuff like that. The usual. Uh, dinner's on, isn't it, Paul? Paul's tired. I'm tired. We're all tired. So uh, the only one that's not tired is a little monster. But then uh, she's a kid. She's allowed. Is it you? Can you see yourself? What are you doing? You playing with your balls? It's fun. Is it fun? <laughs> How's that? Here you go. Love you, baby. Good morning, everybody. It's Sunday. Jennifer got us up at half past six this morning. Not good. Anyway, it's very dark out. It's very rainy. Um, just trying to get Jennifer's coat dry because uh, it needed washing. Uh, it's on the radiator. It's nearly dry. <sighs> We're going to go up the prints on something to eat before we go shopping, I think. I've had no breakfast yet because they used up all my bread yesterday, throwing it to the, um, I wanted to say lions, but to the ducks. So today, print, shopping, mum and dad. Back home, probably colour or sleep, depending on how tired I feel. I don't feel too bad at the moment. But yeah, Paul might have to go out tomorrow uh, with his mum to get her to the doctor's surgery because she doesn't really know where it is. She's not good with technology. So he's going to go with her. So I might have the morning to myself. Depends what time her appointment is. He's trying to get hold of her to find out. And because um, she's moved, so she doesn't know where it is. Um, but I'll try and do a bit of eBay. <laughs> Because I've got a lot of stuff to, to do. I've got some stuff on my phone that needs to be drafted and uh, listed. I've got a load of cameras I can photograph. I've got some computer games that I just need to bundle and sell. And of course I've got a load of clothes. And more cameras up the shed. So I've also got stuff to do up the shed. So my plan for tomorrow is if it is in the morning, when he goes out, is do uh, an hour of photographing and then some drafting and listing. Uh, getting them ready to list and I'll list them in the evening and then I'm going to go up the shed because I've got some rubbish to bring out some recycling that needs to go in the recycling bin I've got uh, some you know boxes to break down and take up because I keep all the Amazon boxes we get and I've got one item to pull which I'll do tonight so I might do a bit of it tonight but uh, well this afternoon because uh, I've got one to go out I've got a return to do um, so I'll do that tonight I've just got to do the label and send it off to the the person which I will and uh, that's it really um yeah I'm gonna go because I haven't had any breakfast and I'm really hungry in the prints now bacon and egg sandwich whoa Ooh. look at that looks gorgeous <laughs> doesn't it Paul yeah. Jennifer's just waiting for her toast don't play with the sugar please we've got a lovely Christmas tree so I am gonna get stuck in with this aren't you daddy yeah, hurry up. why I've got to eat you first have I yeah. mm. right Back home now, the prince um, was lovely. I really enjoyed my bacon and egg sandwich, as did Paul. Didn't you, Paul? Yeah. Jennifer ate all her toast. We were growing some milk and a, a squash. Then we went shopping, went to Grandad's, and somehow this thing came back with us. Do you want me to open that? All right. She's got another one for Christmas. She's going to have a little dinosaur army. Rawr! Isn't you, Jen? Jen? Rawr! Not interested now because she's watching this. Ra! The Rex is coming. There's a Rex here. Ra! I've got to open up a Kinder egg now. See what's in it. The Paw Patrol ones are much better, really. Hey everybody, it's Sunday evening. Jennifer's in bed. Paul's downstairs. I've just had a shower, as you can tell. It's, it's not late, it's half past eight, I think. Um, I'm going to edit this video together while making a couple of videos. Um, and do a colour and chat and... Uh, do you know what? No, I'm not, because I like to put a colour and chat the next day. So I'm just going to edit this video together. I will put up a video. I've got to go back downstairs because I've left my charger for my phone down there. And also my water and something else. A USB stick with um, YouTube videos on that I want to put on my laptop. So I'm not. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch some YouTube. I've discovered a couple of interesting channels um, over the last day. One's called Lost Vocals. So it's about um, 
movie stars who didn't sing their own vocals in films, not through any fault of their own, but because the studio said so, such as Natalie Wood in uh, West Side Story, Eva Gardner in um, her film, <laughs> Kathy Wood always. Uh, oh my God, I can't think of it. Showboat. <laughs> Um, who else was there? Uh, obviously there's uh, some from uh, Singing in the Rain. Um, what was the other one I noticed? Uh, Audrey Hepburn. So I'm looking forward to that and it, it actually plays them, uh, there's the recording of them actually singing the song. And in some cases, uh, from what I understand, they didn't really need to be dubbed but they did for some reason. And, and so, so I'm going to watch that. And another one I have just subscribed to is Exploring with Jake. Um, I follow him on Facebook because I love... Um, looking at abandoned buildings but he's got a youtube channel mostly manchester based so that'll be interesting i've only ever been to manchester once maybe twice so i don't know at all but i do love looking at old buildings and some of them look quite interesting so i'm going to have a look at that and then i'm going to have a look while i've got my laptop open um at a website called Ober City US, which I, I used to look at all the time when I was at Yale, because we could look at the internet in between halls as long as we weren't on the internet when we were taking them. Um, and again, it's uh, abandoned photography, urban exploration as it's called, um, old buildings, so hospital schools, places like that, um, churches, houses, not so many houses, industrial plants, they're fascinating, industrial buildings are fascinating, or, you know, I do find them fascinating. Um, I've done a little bit of urbex in myself, nothing recently, obviously for obvious reasons, but in the past I've been out with my dad, we visited uh, a, re a local church, you can find that on YouTube, not my video, but uh, my pictures are up on the internet, um, it is on one of the channels I follow, can't think of what it's called, but uh, it's called St Luke's Abacan, and then there was the Penelta Colliery as well, um, went there, these pictures are all on various, uh, sites i do have a photo blog that i have not updated in years uh called travels with my camera but it's andrea pryke wordpress something but if you just google me you will find it if you just get, get google andrea pryke, pryke blah, 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 blah. andrea pryke photography or andrea pryke, pryke wordpress blah, 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 blah. wordpress i've got a couple of um blogs on there including a book one which again i have updated this year but only once because i don't read that much i don't get the chance i actually pay to have a custom domain for that so it's something i'm going to seriously start doing again in the new year i've got one review to write um soon which i want to do which i meant to do ages ago and just haven't got around to it so i do want to start a film blog that's one of the reasons why i wanted a new laptop but <sighs> It's coming up with a name for it and having the time with everything else I do so that at the moment that's on a back burner because I haven't watched many films this year again I've got three to add to my log which I will try and do tonight um, but I just don't get the chance to watch films as much as I would like and I do love them I do love films and it's silly because I've got a I got Amazon Prime here I've got YouTube which has got films on it I've got a DVD player up here I've got a load of films I haven't watched up here and most notably I've got Paul Cary Grant up here and downstairs I've got a load of video DVDs I haven't watched I've still got all my VHS Marilyn collection <laughs> I actually do uh, it's in the attic with a load of Judy Garland VHSs as well um, mostly those most of them I'm, I've got rid of um, but I do still collect DVDs occasionally. I don't, I try not to buy them full price. I will if I have to. So for instance, if I wanted a Judy Garland one that I haven't got, it may be £18, but because they're quite rare, I, I will pay that if I want the film. And I do, but not at the moment. So one of the things I'm going to have, I'm going to slow down on next month, uh, next year rather, as much as I love my colouring books, I am going to have to stop buying so many. So the halls are going to be very, very small very small the reason being i've got so many coloring books and i haven't colored in so this apart from the pencil case which is obviously that's my derwent ink tents these are books i haven't colored in yet and that's not all of them that's just the ones on that shelf i do have excuse the mess another shelf here um so those i haven't colored in and there's a few colouring heavens there and there's a uh, tanglewood and the aquarium is there and a load of pdfs and there are also a lot of pdfs i've got on my computer downstairs on my big computer that i haven't printed yet i've got a pdf of jade summer's 100 greatest hits to download so i can i will, will download and print off the ones that i haven't got the books of to see if i like them i've i've got 
I'm a member of free colouring pages. I have enough to colour to last me a lifetime. So I will be buying colouring books, but they will be sporadic and they will have to be something I really want. So for instance, I'm not going to buy the new Hannah Lynn book at the moment. I am tapped out for Christmas, pretty much. I'm going to check my bank in a minute. Um, I've got to be careful because I'm getting tapped out for Christmas and I've still got things to get. So I'm going to have to dip into my savings. I don't have a lot to get, but... But yeah, so it's things like that. My mum does owe me 50 quid though, so that's okay. So I've got to... I've got so many there, I, I do want to colour in them all. So if I could at least... colour half of those next year i'd be happy i don't i will i will um do an updated coloring books i haven't colored in for the new year i'm not going to show you all the coloring books i own and all the coloring books i've colored in because that would take forever although i can if you want me to but i will show you the ones i haven't colored in so i mean obviously i might get a couple for christmas i know i'm getting money for christmas from paul's dad so that might go on coloring books it might not i might buy a film with it i, I haven't decided yet it is whether it's paul did he send us checks last year no paul, i think he directly transferred it into paul's bank account i think and then paul put it into mine but whatever it is i shall choose wisely i do want the mozart um paints watercolors but then i have got my youtube money when it comes through i mean obviously i'm not making a lot it's pennies it really is pennies i think i've, I've been doing it over a month now and i've earned something like 13 pound 14 pound it's not a lot of money it really isn't I'm, i don't make videos for the money if i did i'd be monetizing these videos because they're really long and i could get three or four adverts out throughout the minute throughout the middle i don't these aren't for monetization these are just for fun i do these for fun these ones are just so you can see what's going on anyway i'm gonna stop talking i'm getting cold i'm gonna get dressed because i am not dressed i'm wearing my towel <laughs> it's a guinness one bought it in dublin years and years ago and yeah so i'm gonna get dry and dressed i am going to put on uh youtube there's a few things i might want to watch on youtube tonight before bed I'm obviously going to go and get the memory. Uh, I bought a USB stick to transfer some files over to the new laptop, so I'm going to go and get that. And then I'm going to edit this together. Tomorrow I'll film a colour and chat because I'm hoping tomorrow I'll get some eBay done in the morning when Jennifer's at nursery. We have got a bit of tidying up to do. We need to sort of. Oh, don't ask. Just trying to keep the living room tidy is a nightmare with her because she gets all her toys out. To be fair, if you start putting them back, she will help you. But sometimes it's easier just to wait till she's gone to bed and pick it all up, like they did tonight. She'd picked up most of it, to be fair. So she took that giant dinosaur to bed. I'm going to check on her a minute, make sure she's okay. Might take it out, put it on the chair. So I hope you've enjoyed this weekly vlog. We are hurtling to Christmas. The next three weeks are very interesting because I'm in work, but um, I've got four days this, ne this next week because obviously I'm off tomorrow. Monday when you see this then obviously the following week I'm only in two days because I've got Wednesday Thursday off and Friday's Christmas Day and then the following week I'm only in three days because of course Monday is a bank holiday because Boxing Day falls on a weekend and New Year's Day is a, is Friday so yeah I got three weeks of short weeks although tomorrow next week is the longest but but that's okay I can live with that I'm quite happy and we're going out to Sunday we're going out to lunch next next Sunday not with Jennifer Jennifer's going to my mum and dad's um so we'll probably do the shopping and drop her off put it away and then go up and we're going to the Prince of Wales for their Christmas lunch so they are doing uh four courses it's a soup which is tomato and treats of chili which will be really nice um then a chicken or beef dish which is great because it's not turkey because it's gonna be all turkeyed out after Christmas and uh, then a choice of two desserts don't know what they are and then a cheese board. Now, I won't eat the cheese board. I don't like cheese very much. I certainly don't like cold cheese. Can't bear the stuff. I don't like it on, like, pizzas or ocean pie or lasagna. Even cheese on toast. If it's got Worcestershire sauce and a piece of tomato on it, I'll eat. I just don't like it cold. I don't like cauliflower cheese either. Or mac and cheese. But that's just me. I'm a bit weird. So, I will show you all those courses if I remember. But I will take you with me. I'm really looking... We're both looking forward to it. Because the breakfast we had this morning was... Although it was only a bacon and egg roll or BAP as we call them. It's absolutely bloody lovely. I love the Prince of Wales. It's my favourite pub. I'm not going to lie. It is. 
and I'm really, really looking forward to it. I've been waffling for 10 minutes, so I'm going to go now. Um, hope you've enjoyed the vlog, and I'll see you in the next one.